Mr. Vaishak, hearty congratulations on securing R India Rank 20 in Electronic Communication Paper in Gate 2022. Thanks, sir. Thanks, sir. Yeah, Mr. Vaishak, tell us uh, from our ES Academy, yeah. what type of coaching program that you have taken? Sir, I was in, enrolled in uh, online coaching, deep learning using the app. So yeah. uh, you have well. Uh, Yes, online, deep learn online course, right? Online course, yes, sir. And also test series also. Test series also. Yeah. Right. So, that deep learn online course yeah. you have provided. Yes, sir. Very good. Which is very helpful for my preparations. Uh, content delivered helps me in, uh, like, I have some... Yeah, I, I will ask all those points, Vaishak. Yeah. Right. Uh, see, you please uh, uh, tell us in detail how this uh, yes, deep learn online classes helped you in developing the subject and also uh, cracking this examination with such a good rank of all india rank 20 sure sir so it helped me in uh, from the basics so it helped me in uh, like clearing my concepts and all and also they helped me in uh, to how to you know, approach a problem and you know how to think about a problem and uh, how to develop a efficient answer in short short period of time like that the ex the professors were helpful in you know just they were always uh, uh, thinking about the exam only like that they were uh, helping us so just very helpful and also syllabus also each and every topic was covered which i think is very important because many many students i know they will not cover cover the nj syllabus for gate especially in ec we need to cover uh, every syllabus that's very important so that was also take uh, no, taken care by the professors in deep learning and also the they also completed no they, there was enough time to revise also that also helped uh, in preparation like this. okay vaishak uh, at, at what time you used to attend those uh, online live classes sir uh, usually uh, i recorded only i watched because uh, I, was, I was also working in a, a private company like that so I usually after work uh, night only and morning only I used to watch the lectures like that. So live classes also sometimes you might have watched uh, right? Uh, live times uh, the, it was not uh, very few only I watched because I didn't get the uh, time during that. Uh, so usually mostly I watched uh, record only live was also good because there we can interact also like that. So both are so good. So mostly you have used that recorded, uh, recorded. Record, right? Yes sir, yes sir. Okay, right. Uh, uh, Vaishak. Yes. Uh, while watching those uh, videos of yes, ES deep learning recorded videos, uh, whenever you get some doubts, etc., so how you used to get them clarified? Yeah, there we can, uh, like, there is an option to where you can interact with the faculty it's like faculty. that. Yeah, yeah, then they will ask uh, the expert, right? Expert, uh, ask the expert like that, then they will respond within some time, they will usually respond as our queries also. So that was very useful for you. Very useful, yes, sir. Right. Uh, and one more, uh, Vaishak, while watching those uh, uh, live classes, otherwise the record ones, uh, did you prepare simultaneously any notes also? Yeah, yes, sir, sure. I uh, I made the online uh, notes only because we need to again revise after some time. So it's very important to make the notes. And also short notes also I made after that, again, like that. So I, I made the notes also while listening to the classes simultaneously like that. Okay, you have prepared a short initially full length notes, uh, then short afterwards notes. Uh, short notes also yeah. you have prepared. Yes, sir. Right. Uh, what about that uh, practice question bank? Yes, yes, yes. How did uh, you manage that one? Practice question bank. Actually, I, uh, to be honest, I didn't get uh, that much time to solve all the questions, but I tried my best to because most of the questions are similar to the gate questions only. So it's very good only if you get time it's very good only but i didn't get that much time so i spend most of the time in previous year questions only like that but previous year's questions and some mock tests yeah. also you have taken right yeah, yeah, yeah. mock tests mostly i was uh, yeah. concentrating so those questions also simulate the same gate pattern yes yes, yes. same pattern also might have been yeah. helpful to you yeah, yeah, yeah the test series especially it was very because there were many test series like subject choice topic wise and full length mock tests like that so it's very important when you complete a subject, you uh, like practice the subject right as it will be very helpful because we can find where whether we are weak and we can improve that area in a particular okay. subject like that. Okay. Yeah. Vaishak, tell us when which college are you from? When did you pass out and where are you working presently? 
so i was uh, no i did my btech in from college of indian in chengannur only here kerala government college afterwards i did my mdec in uh, from nit calicut in telecommunication the last year only so afterwards i got placed in a company private company and i was working there only simultaneously i was preparing for the gate mainly for psc only so like that so so you have you are already mtech mtech yeah. you did your M- uh, masters from nit calicut you That's got true. some campus placement from private company yeah so you took the gate exam this year yes. uh, with the main intention of uh, trying yes. some psu psu right yes. yes sir yes yes very good i think 20th rank definitely you'll get some top psu thanks sir thanks okay. hope so yeah yeah definitely you'll get we wish you all right thanks. uh vishak you might have taken earlier gate exams also yes yes sir i have given what, what were your ranks in the earlier gate exams earlier my rank was around uh, 2000 only after btech i attempted at that uh, time it was 2200 like that only okay because at that time i didn't uh, give any mock test and all and uh, didn't complete the syllabus and all then i realized my mistakes and i tried to rectify this time like that so okay good uh, vaishak so earlier you got a 2000 rank before uh-huh. you joined your mtech yeah yeah this time in 2022 gate examination you got a 20th rank yeah so compared to your previous preparation what changes that you have made this time while preparing for the gate examination Yes. by availing our as academy deep learn online like courses yes sir so because uh, in that we i was preparing self only i didn't join any coaching and all first time when i prepared so i was mostly referring a reference textbook and all like that but it's a very difficult to because the time is, time will not be there to complete the entire syllabus using reference text and all that's the problem main so i was not able to complete the entire syllabus before the exam i was only completed like 60 70% they like the syllabus only so that itself was a i was in like uh, ba- in backward only afterwards the, i was not even no i w- didn't get time to give the test series also so only one or two test series i given so i didn't get the time but this time because of this uh, recorded videos and all i didn't uh, go for any reference textbook and all i just uh, concentrated on the videos given by the professors only here and just made a, a, my my own notes and i prepared from that only and i gave more importance to pro- problem solving only rather than going for more theory i concentrated more on problem solving like that because gate 90% is a problem only like that so i try try to focus on that skill only sir mostly this thing so okay those are changes that you have yes, made there yes, yes. okay well well said uh, vaishak so you mean to say that uh, test books may not be necessary Yeah, yeah, I th- because the syllabus is very vast, you will not get uh, that yes, much time. Yes, absolutely, you are right, you are right. That's the way. It's not, I'm not saying it's necessary, but for gate, gate uh-huh. I would say it is... Uh, what I mean right. to say, what I mean to say, Vaishyak, if everything is available yes, in yes. the, what you call, classes, yeah, yeah. or the recorded videos, etc., if everything is available there, yes, you sir. don't require to spend extra time again by uh-huh. referring to a test book. That's what I mean to say. No. we can do that when you are going for mdec only then we can give more time to reading reference textbook and all but gate i don't think it is necessary so you felt this is more than sufficient for gate yes. examination yes sir yes sir right yeah so can you suggest the same thing to your juniors yeah yeah sure. of course i will suggest that only because if you want to go deep into your subject it's better you take mdec and then you can no if you are but interested in some subject and all for gate is better you know you join a good institute like as and all there already process know what you need to do and focus on that only focus more on problem solving like that rather than going for more theory like that i would recommend all my juniors and if everyone is watching just uh, do that only it should be better for you like that right okay vishak uh, vishak uh, you tell us uh, what was your approach on the gate examination day the 3 hours time uh, yeah. how did you plan how, uh, to attempt those questions Can you please uh, narrate something about your actual examination experience? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for in the examination day, my plan was like to I will start from technical and I will start all the questions which was easy for me, like which is clicking directly like that. So I will just scan through the questions and if, if I am able to connect, no, if I am able to connect something, then I will do solve like that directly. First, first like that only. So I, I think I don't know exact number I solve, but. i think around 40 questions like that i solved in the first way itself and uh, i marked some 10 uh, 15 questions for mark for review and then i went for this mark for review questions after that it's like moderate level questions moderate to difficult level questions so i would suggest to first you solve easy questions because it will build our 
the confidence also then uh, it will you no know, you will get some confidence then go for difficult and moderate to difficult questions like that my plan was like that sir right yeah good good so could you solve most of the questions in the given time yeah, yeah i was uh, i think around 58 questions so 60 60 questions i was able to solve in the given time okay but some of your easy students what they are saying is this time the paper was a somewhat tough yeah. yes, yes yes is it really true yeah some questions were a little difficult new type of questions came which was never asked the previous like new pattern like that so it's a very important you don't waste too much time uh, in one question if you don't know just leave that don't need to have some ego or something like that just leave and go for it's very important because sometimes i know in first day first time when i wrote also i like wasted my one question 10 minutes like that i wasted but the i this time i was like i will not waste more than five minutes in one question if i don't know i will just leave like that that's why difficult question and uh, five to six difficult questions were there a very difficult question i just left to that so i didn't that like that. yeah that is what i was asking you yeah. you need to have some strategy yes, yes. what to do in the examination hall yeah, yeah. when you do not know some of the tough questions there yes sir and moreover in our ec this time yeah. there were a good number of msqs also there yes yes yes, yes. so what was your feeling after seeing those msqs so in ec you, you don't need to score 100 or 90 like that you know it's not like mechanical we, we just need to score i think 80 70 to 80 you will get in you know, uh, like single reach or good triangle you will get so my strategy was like only i was not uh, aiming for 100 marks I, in, in this time uh, that was our uh, said rightly m, m, like msq was a, like a you know, training point like that because last year, no, I think no, first time only, I think MSQ was introduced in EC like that. So that was a challenging thing, but I uh, I just uh, solved those questions which I am able to click like that only MSQ or MCQ like that. I, that was my strategy. Right. Okay, Mr. Vaishak. See, uh, in your uh, electronics, uh, there are various uh, subjects, right? Yes, sir. Uh, while preparing and while watching these videos, did you follow any particular sequence so as to make preparation easy otherwise you prepared randomly as and when whatever you feel comfortable yes sir i first i started with the basic subjects like natural theory signals digital uh, max then i went to the advanced subjects like communication emg like that because you need some basic knowledge about signals and probability and all to do well in these communication and the subjects like that so it's better if you start from the basic subjects, then go forward to the core subjects like that. I feel like that. Okay, right. And Vaishak, one more, let me ask you one question. In your EC, uh, which are the easy subjects, which are the relatively hard subjects? In for, me, for me, personally, sir. In general, in general, in general, you tell me. General, I think when I'm discussing with friends and all, I think easy subjects are nature theory, digital. Uh, and analog is also, I would say, easy subjects, but most controls. of the people, analogs. Controls also, right? Control also, yes. Uh, most of the people will say EMG only, that's the difficult subject. I think, I, um, I discussed, I think everyone says EMG only. Okay. Like, and communication also. Communication also somehow. But for me, I did my MDEC in communication, so it was not that much difficult for me, like afterwards. Okay. Yeah. Suppose if I ask you, what are the highly scoring subjects in your EC? Can you name me four or five highly scoring subjects in the get get point of view? Yeah, gate code of view, I would say analog, uh, control systems, signals, and uh, communication are the for me scoring subjects. Natural course, course, yes, yes, natural course. Highly scoring subjects. Yeah, yeah, highly scoring subjects. Okay, good, uh, Vesha, good. Uh, what are your uh, parents? Uh, so my father and uh, my mother is there, and my brother, that's my family. My mother is a housewife, and my father is a businessman, shop like that. Is okay so they are not uh, employed right that business yeah. yeah yes yes so what was their contribution in your success yeah of course uh, their engagement and the support was always with me that's why yeah. i was able to yeah without the support of yeah. parents it's difficult to carry mm. preparation yes, yes, yes. Okay. their blessings Very and their support mm -hmm. uh Vishak, finally from your experience right yeah. um, do you want to share any more further points to the aspirants of the gate examination particularly in our electronics branch yeah, I would say is to, first of all, the believe in yourself and uh, no need to know. Even if test series also, if you get some low score or something, don't get uh, discouraged from that. Try to learn from your mistakes and uh, try to rectify that. That's very important for me. And I would say 
also from gate point of view try to complete as much uh, syllabus as possible because in easy you cannot leave any topic you cannot you never know what question they will ask in next year like that the, there are so try to be positive and uh, just uh, go through what the professors are uh, saying they know better so just uh, listen to them blindly and just follow them and do well that's all right yeah. so suppose if i ask you uh, ideally uh, how much time required for this uh, preparation to get a good rank what do you say let us say in terms of months four months five months six months yeah approach me what is your your take in this particular so direction? honestly i think it depends on the student only because each student the learning power is different some some may like like six to eight months they can finish the entire syllabus some may take one year like that so i would i don't say uh, i cannot say generally but for me i think for syllabus i think it take me eight to ten months like that for to cover the and this was like so i think that's a good time period to eight to month you can complete the entire syllabus and you can start doing the series like that. six to so eight for a for a serious student eight to around eight months yeah, time eight months or eight months time for a serious yeah. student sufficient yeah, yeah. right yeah. okay good good okay uh, thank you mr vaishak for sharing your valuable thoughts with us thanks sir uh, we wish you good luck in all your future attempts and congratulate you once again thanks sir thanks sir it was a pleasure meeting you sir and talking to you yeah right